station, about to meet my friend Lucy because we are going to see the Backstreet Boys tonight. My 10 year old self is beyond excited. I never thought I'd get to see them. Um, but we managed to get some cheap tickets. We're right at the back. <laughs> but I think it's gonna be so fun. And Lucy and I haven't seen each other for ages. So we are gonna grab some food first. Um, just on South Bank, it's absolutely tipping it down. So hopefully we can find somewhere with some space. Um, but yeah, I'll take you with me. Here's my girl. <laughs> Woo! I'm just gonna awkwardly vlog. I love it. We are just in work for it. We can't hear anything. We're just gonna grab some food before we go and see. <laughs> We've come to the market. What is this called? Some South Bank Market, is it? Oh. South Bank. <laughs> I was going to say Waterloo. Waterloo yeah, Market? Yeah, South Bank Food Market. Oh, yeah. 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 Waffles. We're in the search of something sweet after lunch, which I didn't film because we ate it. We ate it. <laughs> <laughs> we ate it. Oh, look. Ooh. Oh, yeah. Oh. Look at that. Ooh. Vegan. We've just got to the OT. I'm holding my cakes. Lucy's bought some cupcakes. Good. Good. We're really very excited because we have cupcakes. Everyone see much of us. Um, contemplating getting in this merchandise queue because Lucy we wants a t-shirt but I secretly also want a t-shirt. I feel like um, we're, Steph's we're gonna going to be like, <laughs> it's going to be a massive turn off. <laughs> <laughs> we're, we're getting in the queue. Lucy bought me a Lola's cupcake. <laughs> Although I feel like I'm a little bit jealous of yours. You should be. <laughs> We've come for an alcohol free drink. What did you get? We look like vampires. No, like we're so pale. I don't know, it tastes really nice. nice. Something Le Palomero or something? I don't know what it is. Some fizzy, some basically lemonade for eight pounds. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> today <laughs> I got home at about half past 12 a little bit later last night which is really late for me I always go to bed at 10 I'm like literally asleep at 10 normally so I'm really tired today and I had to run for my train because I really didn't want to miss the last song it's like my favorite song so I ran and I, I literally got sweat on through London running for tubes and running for trains I just made it with three minutes to spare um, which was so lucky but we had the best night, it was so fun. Like I literally cried at one point because I couldn't believe that I got to see like my favorite childhood band. Um, so yeah, it was really good fun. It was just really sad to see um, Nick Carter crying on stage because his brother passed away like literally the day before the show. Um, so that was really sad, but it was an amazing show and yeah, really glad we did it. It was a very last minute thing. Um, so yeah, it was so much fun. Today I'm um, back back down to earth. The kids are at school and I have a big to-do list. I have a couple of um, reels to make for two brands that I'm working with, it's BMW and Sky. I've also got a carousel and some copy to do. I also have a class to make for yoga tonight and what else will I do? I've got a big to-do list here. I've got to promote my Wednesday yoga class, a couple of people to reply to, some copy to write. So yeah, it's a busy day and I've kind of lost my voice from screaming at Nick Carter. <laughs> so um, hopefully I don't have to do my voiceovers today because I, found, I feel like I sound rough. But um, yeah, that's what I'm doing. Got my little candle lit, got my big thing of water, got my... Um, little collagen thing here ready to hopefully um revive my skin from inside out today although saying that i drank so much water yesterday and um lucy and i didn't drink or anything at the gig so i don't feel like 
hungover or anything. I'm, I can't remember if I've told you guys I'm just not drinking anymore. I'm like four months sober. Um, I might make a whole separate video on that if anyone's interested. Um, it's a funny one for me to talk about though, because I don't feel like I had like necessarily like a problem with it. I just didn't like my relationship with it. So I just decided just to not drink anymore. Um, but yeah, I'll go into deeper details in another video. But for now, I am just gonna start getting on with some work because it's 10 o'clock and the school day goes quickly. <laughs> Look at these little babies. They haven't been for their walk yet because it's absolutely pouring down and I need to um, measure them both up for coats. Pip's grown out of her coat from last year. So she's gonna have to borrow George's today. George's gonna have to go naked because Georgie's got like that type of coat where he dries really quickly anyway and he doesn't mind the rain, but she hates the rain. She hates it so much. So um, yeah, we'll measure them up later. And look at them. Also, just how cosy how cosy are they i love them so much i keep moving them from room to room i just um actually really kindly got gifted some vouchers for amazon and um so i got another set of these for downstairs because they're just the best um and i also got a candelabra like version i'm gonna show you later on um but yeah they're so cozy i love them By the way, there's this um, YouTube channel which I really like putting on when I'm working. It's such chill music. It's called, you probably already know it, it's like famous, um, but it's called Lo-Fi Girl. And they just do like massive, I think this is like hours and hours long, <laughs> but it's really long and it's just really chill music. It's nice to have them in the background when you're working. I have done half my work. Um, I'm going to take a break now while the rain has stopped and walk these little munchkins. Wanna go for a walk? You wanna go for a walk, guys? Wanna go walkies? <laughs> your face, George. God, back from the dog walk. I look so dead. <laughs> I, I'm just gonna make a little lunch. I say lunch, it's more like a snack. I'm gonna have some sardines on toast. I'm gonna grill them. Um, some people find that really gross. I think I get that from my mum. She used to always make that. Um, I don't know, it's just an easy, like tasty lunch. I love sardines as well. So I'm gonna have that and then carry on with my work. I think maybe it's just me feeling a bit run down because I just spent three hours singing and screaming last night and then got home really late, so that's probably why I'm feeling a bit rough. Anyways, I'm gonna make my sardines now. I need to wash my hands before I touch my camera though because it's stink. Let me show you while I'm waiting for that to grill my candles. <laughs> these are the other electric candles. They're actually battery powered, these ones. Which is a bit annoying because I wanted them to be like just plug in ones. But you switch them on at the bottom of that. And then, I don't know if you can see that, but they kind of like flicker. They're really cool. And they have this little remote control where you can put them on a timer. So you don't have to remember to switch them off and you can turn them like up, I don't know if you can see that, and then you can turn them down to dim them. Um, and I love them, I'm obsessed with them, I want them in every room. <laughs> um, but for anyone who's looking to cozy up their house this time of year, these are a really nice addition. I actually got them for a job that I'm filming tomorrow where I have to do like a dinner table setting. And I just thought instead of like navigating flames um, and 
then just having like with those candlesticks the wax always goes down the side and like then you have to rebuy all the candles and shit i thought oh i'll just get just battery ones this time oh this looks so good yeah i'm gonna link them down below because i totally rate them and they're just so cozy and you don't have to worry about setting your house on fire Realise this probably looks disgusting, but it's so tasty if you like sardines. That one's delish. I have <clears throat> I just got a message from the girl that runs the yoga studio that I teach in and she has said that she's blocked off my class tonight because she saw I went out last night. She thought I might need a rest. So I'm feeling very grateful for that because my throat's sore and I mean <laughs> so yeah, that's so good to know. Also because there's a Selena Gomez um, documentary that I want to watch. I'm not really a fan of hers. I don't really know any of her songs or anything, but it's about mental health. So I'm just really interested to see um, what they've done with it. And I don't know, I just saw a little clip and it looks like a really brave thing to put out there. So I want to watch that tonight and just cuddle up on the sofa with the dogs and like hibernate. <laughs> it is time to go and get the kiddies. I just did a little bit of yoga down there it was so comfy doing it on that um just trying to update my zoom for my yoga class this week and telling me i need to install new software and i don't know what the password is does anyone ever have this i'm like i have no freaking clue what this password is and there's no option for like send a new password so i'm like hmm, what do i do it's kind of annoying. Just got back from the school run. The boys are playing some video games. Went to the shop on the way home. Um, I'll show you what I got. Let's put you over here. We got a massive bunch of bananas because I didn't get to make them this morning and the bananas just go so quickly at our house. It's crazy. Then some blueberries, porridge in the morning, some oat milk, some of these Nutella bars because they're amazing, some little munch bunch yogurts for the kids because maybe because I used to like these when I was a kid. I think they're actually just full of sugar. Um, and some milk, normal milk, and then some grapes which the kids have already packed into. And yeah, that is my little close school. Cool. post school hall. Um, I'm gonna kick this tonight. I'm gonna kick this tonight. I thought um, it just looked really nice and hearty for this time of year. And it's one of those recipes that I think everyone will eat. So I'm gonna do that and then I'm gonna clean the kitchen afterwards because um, there's no point cleaning it before I cook, so yes. Quarter past seven, and the kids are in bed, but they're not asleep, they're just playing some weird game. <laughs> Steph's working tonight because we have a deadline for loads of stuff tomorrow. <coughs> I'm making hot chocolate, I'm making bare bones with cow's milk for Steph, and then I'm gonna make a mix of bare bones and Cadbury's with some oat milk for me. And then um, I've got a couple of little dishes out. I'm going to take him a snack out. But I've got these amazing crisps, which we had on a shoot last week. <laughs> and I brought some home with me because they were so good. They're like um, truffle crisps. I'll show you in a minute. But they are literally the best crisp experience I've ever had in my life. And so I have that and the new Selena Gomez um, documentary to watch tonight which i'm really excited about i don't actually know any of her songs or i don't really know i know of her but i don't really like follow her or anything um <clears throat> but i'm just interested to see what somebody with that level of fame chooses to share and how they've like put it together and what they're talking about and stuff so i think it's quite a yeah i think it's quite a brave thing to put up so I'm gonna watch that I'll let you know what I think if it's worth a watch 
I'm gonna have to go and tell the kids off now. <laughs> These are the crisps. So I'm gonna put them in a kid's bowl <laughs> for Steph. Just lit the fire. Got my little area already. Got my other electric candle. Haven't really tidied up properly, but yeah. Here we go. Here is my little setup. Could not be happier about this. Actually got a hot water bottle as well because of my grandma. Hot water bottle, hot chocolate, truffle crisps, and a documentary. I think I'm going to have to put the dogs back in the kitchen though because they can't stop humping each other and it's really annoying. <laughs> hello, hello, good morning. Steph and I are back at the little studio that we rented out a couple of weeks ago. We've come to take some stills this time um, because we ran out of time last time. So just set up the little screen at the back and the lights and everything. I'm going to take some pictures. <laughs> Um, yeah, I'm going to take some photos for my next yoga program and some for the website. Little camera set up to film some reels. I'm going to film the reels over here. We are wrapped. I'm just going to turn off some of the equipment. Um, yeah, I'm going to go home and get all that stuff imported. And I also have a job to do um for a brand that i'm working with on instagram before school pick up some stories that i have to film so we'll do it right, just about managed to finish my work it was a bit of a dash though so i didn't read i didn't really film much of it um i turn my little lights off it's still my favorite things ever it's funny because whenever we have friends come over as well i get so many compliments on them and everyone's like send me the link send me the link um so i'm gonna put the link below again um in case any of you are interested best thing i bought all year <laughs> i'm gonna go and get the boys put some clothes on first though <laughs> we're just about to put the boys to bed i think i'm gonna end this video here just because i don't want to drag it out over like a million days <laughs> um so it's going to be short and sweet, but I hope you enjoyed it and I will see you all next time. Bye!